Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be showing you my latest Simply Gilded order as well as organizing um, these sticker albums with what I plan on keeping in them. So first I'll show you what I got. I did get some freebies. Let me grab them. I forgot to get them out for the thumbnail which is fine but here are the freebies. So I have this little rainbow tie-dye bow which is adorable. This um, sampler freebie, it says 65. I guess she keeps track of them in order, but it's like a St. Patrick's Day themed, which is really cute. And then this a journaling card that says so rare. Um, it's got that gorgeous foil on it. So those were the freebies, which are always appreciated. And then I also got two of the large albums. So I have, I'm sorry, I forgot the names. Um, I'll try to leave it up on the screen if they're still available on the website as of filming this, but this is a snowflake one, so you can see in silver it's got snowflake patterns and it's a light blue, and then on the inside is just this like iridescent white kind of, um, and then I just put some sticky notes with how I wanted to organize it, so that, that did not come with it. And then I got this, um, I think it's galaxy i don't know what it's called but it is like a like a night sky type situation and then on the inside it has a really pretty like champagne type color to it um which is really nice so for these i'm going to i plan on organizing my stickers winter themed kits will be and winter themed foil winter themed anything will be in this one and then this one will be kind of my themed kits so like celebration birthday anniversary travel moving you know anything that has like a specific purpose to use it for will go in here so I think I'm going to go with the winter one because I've kind of thought about how I want this to be organized as you can see I have some sticky notes on here so these albums come with a really nice um like I guess cello I don't really know what to call them but they're double-sided so there's a pocket on this side and then a pocket on this side as well and it has the punch in the middle which is a nice divider so I think what I'm going to do on this side will be the foil and on this side will be all the kits and I went ahead and went through my collection and picked out literally every single winter themed item I could find and by winter I mean truly winter themed like snowflakes um I guess like log cabin campfire you know things like that but also any holiday themed item that takes place in winter with the exception of Christmas because I'm going to have my own album for that. So um, that'll be New Year's, Valentine's Day. I think that's it actually. If any other winter things come up I'll add them but for now I think those are the two holidays. So what I think I'm going to do is first do the kits because the kits are just going to go in the second half and those are just kind of plug and chug situation. So I think I'll put it in order of holidays. So first I'll have like general winter themed, like anytime winter, and then like kits that I most likely will use in December winter, you know, because um, I guess there kind of is a difference there. Um, I guess this is anytime winter, anytime winter, and this is Valentine's Day. So I will go in order. So I think I'll do the anytimes or the generals first. And I used to keep them, the reason why I'm changing, I probably should have mentioned this earlier, but the reason why I'm changing my storage system is because I used to have all non-claimed, non-dated kits in here. But as you can see, which let me try to lift this up a little bit. It is very fat and I am running out of room in it and it was just wasn't very practical for me anymore because it was just a little overwhelming and because I really only use kits that match the season unless they're any time um I use kits that match the season I figured why don't I just have all of my season kits together in one place so I'm not flipping through literally my entire collection to find a specific themed kit so I decided to do that and when I went on Simply Gilded's website because in my opinion she has very good quality albums so I went on her website and um I only found the snowflake one and the galaxy themed one that would work because I also want to do one for um fall 
one for spring and summer and spring and summer I'm going to combine them because I they really aren't that different and I don't think I have that many kits slash items that would fill two separate ones anyway so I think I'm going to get one for spring and summer and then one for Halloween and one for Christmas but I couldn't find any specific um albums that I kind of that really spoke to me to use for those purposes other than the winter and the, the themed one so that's why I just got these two and then as Irene releases more albums and more patterns I'm sure some will come up that I like and I'll get those as they become available so this is all of the winter themed kits that I have so again I just have general winter in the front Valentine's Day and then kind of like Christmas winter um, behind it so that's all for kits because that was pretty easy and then next are the random bits and bobs as well as foil so I kind of have a general outline of what I want to do and I think I'll stick with this I don't I might stick with this order but I don't know if I don't have for example if I don't have any winter scripts I don't know if I want to leave this section blank or just move on to the next one um so I don't know I mean it turns out that I do have winter scripts so I'll just stick this in here um and then I'm not going to separate it by foil just because I don't have that many items to separate and if I did separate them I, it would take up this entire album I wouldn't have any room for the kit so I'm not going to do that so so winter themed foil winter themed overlays which I'm going to count so this is a winter quote this I'm counting as an overlay this is a quote and then this is the last winter item which is like a cabin type um, full box or double box I should say so winter quotes like I said, I don't really have that many. There's really only one or two sheets in each of these, which is, I mean, which is totally fine. Um, but now I have a nice place to store things as I get new ones. So for New Year's, I only have one item. I don't have scripts, so I might leave the sticky note there if it's not filled. Um, I don't have any overlays, which I honestly don't know if there are any specific, I guess like champagne bottle theme type thing. I'll just leave that there. Um, New Year's quotes. And then I don't have any extras for New Year's. So on to Valentine's Day scripts. Overlays. And for oh, Valentine's overlays, I'm just going to pull anything that really has a heart. Um, cause I don't really use hearts that often cause I do think that they are relatively specific. So I'm just going to put them with Valentine's day. And if I ever need it for a non Valentine's kit, I know where to find it. Um, so those are the overlays. I don't think I have any quotes. I think I used the one that I had. Um, and then Valentine's day extra. And then I forgot that I did have a couple of these. So these are snowflake overlays, which will go in here. And then just a general winter themed sheet, which I can use for the deco there. Okay, so that was actually a lot easier than I thought it would be. But I think that's mainly because I have those sticky notes ready and I kind of thought about it a little bit whereas for this one I haven't really thought about it I did pull out all of the items that I think will go in here but I haven't really figured out the categories or really the order that I want so I have a moving themed kit which now that I'm looking at it Glam planner kits will not fit in here. So I'm just going to set that aside. So I don't really have a moving themed section now. So I think instead of how I separated before between foil and kit, I might just keep themes together like foil and kit. Um, so 
I'll do travel first since I'm more likely to use travel items. So I'll put the overlays first and then I guess I'll just stack in all the start stacking all the kits. In. And then if there is a foil that came with it or goes with the kit, I just have it in the back. And then after the general travel stuff, I have city specific travel. Um, oh, so this is a glam planner. That's not going to fit. Okay, so that's all for travel. And then I have celebration. So I don't know if I want to. Let's see. Okay, so I kind of separated my functional oil items here. Um, so I have like this galaxy star themed stuff, birthday, sports, um, this is just random holidays, weddings, and then like engagement specific stuff. Like this will be stuff that I use for myself. Um, so I don't know how, I think I'm going to do the general holiday up here in this little folder and then so travel so I'll do celebration next so I'll do birthday and then wedding and I'll keep the foil separate because you kind of use them for different reasons even though they fit under the same like general umbrella celebration category and then I'll just put the kits in because the kits are a little bit more general and you could really use any of them for a birthday or a wedding depending on the vibe you're going for. So, I mean, this one is more of a birthday be just because of that card. But if you get rid of that card, it could be a wedding. Um, same with this one. This one is pretty general. So this one I'm going to put here. And then the last one that I have is pretty specific. This is basically a wedding um, or really it is only for a wedding. So I'm going to put that there since that is more specific. And then I'll just put all of my engagement stickers in here since that's still part of the celebration category. And I guess that'll be it. So that's all I'm going to do for that section. And then at this divider, I'll kind of use this as a separate section. I'll put sports. And by sports, I, I really mean kind of like the Super Bowl and the Olympics, since those are kind of like a special event situation. Um, and then I would have put it in the holiday section. Um, but because for the Olympics, especially that it, although Super Bowl could be in the winter, maybe I'll do... Uh, no, because I kind of associate those together and the Super Bowl is always in the winter. So that would be fine going in this um, album. But the Olympics switch between the summer and the winter. So I, I kind of want it in one place and not in like, you know, have it to be associated with the season. And then I just have a general celestial star moon um, theme here as well. So that was also a lot easier than I expected. And I really like how these kits just fit perfectly in here and everything is all together and easy to find. So that is all for my Simply Gilded haul as well as my new storage system. And then as I get more albums and more categories, I will make sure to have you guys follow along and show you what I do with these albums. So don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a good day. Bye-bye.